Pochettino revealed Chelsea were looking for other options after losing Alice, the 21-year-old has refused the opportunity to move to Stamford Bridge by signing a new contract with Crystal Palace, and the only best option is to use Armando Broja which has just recovered from its injury, as revealed by Pochettino in the pre-match conference. Before facing West Ham United, Pochettino said, we are working, of course we see all the options that we can manage in the market, we can see the potential, but I think at the same time, we maintain one or two eyes at Armando Broja, we can't forget it, we can't stop it, we really believe in him, we know how important he is to Chelsea, I think this is a big disappointment with the situation of Christopher Nkunku, because he should be a very important player for us and to help Nico. That is football and we have to accept the situation. Newcastle approved the cost with Chelsea over Lewis Hall, after seeing the conversation about the loan to Crystal Palace failed, Chelsea had decided to make the 18-year-old academy graduate, who spent the days of the young team playing in midfield but was comfortable at the left back, 90 Minutes understands that Newcastle has agreed to a package that can be worth up to £35 million for Chelsea, with Hall will move to St James Park with an initial loan agreement that includes the obligation to Move permanently next summer, Newcastle encourages a loan agreement in the midst of concerns over the financial fair play and will now be able to add Hall to Newcastle next season. The Hall travelled to Newcastle on Friday for a medical examination before signing a contract with the Magpies. Newcastle boss Eddie Howe confirmed the conversation about the Hall was almost complete and admitted he did not expect the further transfer business this summer. Eddie Howe said, he is the player I like, very versatile, his potential is very good, I think if we can bring in players, our transfer business will be finished unless there is an injury in our own player. Moyes gave Chelsea's double warning for the transfer before the West Ham match, David Moyes has warned Chelsea that their latest summer shopping came without guarantee of success pointing to West Ham's own struggle after their reshuffle 12 months ago. Both sides met in the Premier League at the London Stadium on Sunday, when the signing of the British new transfer record Moises Caicedo could be one of several debutants of the Blues after his move from Brighton worth £115 million finally. Confirmed at the beginning of the week, on Friday, Chelsea also announced the arrival of fellow midfielder Romeo Labia from Southampton with a £58 million transfer that spent their expenses in three transfer windows since the takeover of Todd Bowley has almost reached £1 billion. However, the injection of similar funds last summer and January failed to trigger an increase in yield on the field, with the Blues finishing in 12th in the 2022-23 season that was disappointing, and David Moyes was not afraid with the prospect of dealing with expensive players Mauricio Pochettino, David Moyes said, they also spent a lot of money last year and it didn't always work for them. That doesn't always mean that spending money guarantees your success, Chelsea have the right to work in their way, they have done their own things for years and are very successful. I think they are trying to succeed again, they have recruited many very talented players. Chelsea players are travelling today to finish the Stamford Bridge exit, Hakim Ziyech travelled to Turkey today to complete the move to Galatasaray, that was according to journalist Yagai Sabunkwaglu, who said that the Chelsea outlet almost secured his move from Stamford Bridge, Ziyech is part of the group of Chelsea players who want to move before the end of the window, he is clearly not part of Mauricio Pochettino's plan to the future, he almost moved to Saudi Arabia, but the agreement collapsed when Ziyech failed in a medical examination and Al Nasser withdrew the transfer potential. Since then Ziyech has been trapped to find new destinations, training away from the Chelsea first team after it is clear that Pochettino has no place for him. Galatasaray has emerged as a possible goal for him, pushing the agreement for the past week or more when they are preparing to lose Nicolo Zanolo to Aston Villa, Yagai Sabunkwaglu now reports that Ziyech will fly to Turkey today to complete the last part of the transfer, does he finish something tonight or leave it until tomorrow is not mentioned, but however, his departure from Chelsea is now almost complete. Bad news for Chelsea fans when Pochettino revealed Rhys James will be absent for weeks, Mauricio Pochettino has revealed on Friday that club captain Rhys James will be absent for weeks rather than days after suffering a new injury, 
The right back experienced problems during training on Wednesday to give Pochettino another setback in the early days of his term of office at Chelsea. This English star is known as an injured player and he has to overcome this time to give an influence with the West London club this season. Chelsea have confirmed that James has begun a rehabilitation program after suffering a hamstring injury, while Pochettino believes the time on the sidelines will not be a few days. But a few weeks, this 23-year-old player is of course one of the most talented wingbacks in this sport, but this injury problem is a big problem for him and Chelsea. Speaking of James, during his press conference on Friday, Pochettino said, This is a sad moment because he is our captain and he is very eager to be our captain and full of energy. I think we will judge him day after day and surely as soon as possible he will return to the team and surely become stronger than before. Because with the club structure, we will help him become stronger than before. This is not about a few days, maybe a few weeks, but the most important thing is evolution. The good thing is not a big problem. Prediction of starting lineup Chelsea vs West Ham United Premier League Match Week 2. Chelsea lineup formation 3 4 2 1. Goalkeeper. Robert Sanchez Center back Tiago Silva Center back Axel De Sacy Center back Levi Colwill Center midfield Enzo Fernandez Center midfield Moises Caicedo Right wing back Malo Gusto Left wing back Ben Chilwell Attacking midfielder Noni Maduk Attacking midfielder Michael O. Mudrick Striker Nicholas Jackson Okay guys, that's the prediction for the starting lineup for Chelsea vs West Ham United. What do you think? Don't forget to write your opinion in the comments column. Chelsea central defender Trevo Chalaba was absent for a month due to a hamstring injury. Chelsea were again hit by injuries because Trevo Chalaba suffered a hamstring injury, which will make him absent with captain Rhys James for several weeks. According to Athletic, the central defender experienced mild hamstring problems, but the problems seem to be getting worse during the exercise. He is now likely to be absent for one month or more, even has the potential to hamper the opportunity to move before the transfer window is closed. Chalaba did not participate in the Chelsea match on Sunday and now had to be absent for a month. Luckily, the Blues have enough options in their central defender area. While the young man is not a starter for the club, his absence will limit the options available to Mauricio Pochettino. The 23-year-old player is associated with the exit because Inter Milan is interested in contracting the Chelsea Academy players and the Blues open to sell it. But now the central defender can miss one month of action due to injury. Chalaba has been deployed from the order of power and he is now behind Weasley Fofana, Thiago Silva, Axel de Sesai, Levi Colwell, and Benoit Badiashile. The steps for him will be suitable to get good playing time, but it is now impossible at least in the coming weeks.